When we think of technology, we think of modern equipment and modern understanding. But what if all of our knowledge in the today and now were simply based on ideas and beliefs that have manifested over thousands of years? Perhaps we are not discovering these ideas in modern times. They may have always been present in our consciousness and in a way, the modern world is based on principles and ideas that are old as humanity itself. The reason we say this is because no matter how many thousands of years of history we delve into, we always seem to uncover hidden depths. Hidden or lost knowledge that falsifies what we have been educated to believe. No matter where we look on this world or how we try to explain away history, we always come to an understanding that there was an ancient empire across this world in the very distant past and that the Great Flood seems to have been the cataclysmic event that brought about their downfall. Every now and again, we come across ancient evidence that we don't understand. So what if we were to tell you that 500 years ago, such knowledge fell into the hands of a guy called Conard Has, who either did not understand what he had or did not have the means to put into action a technological breakthrough that has liberated travel on our world today. Wait till you hear this. Published in the 16th century and documented using texts that were far older and almost destroyed by time, the CBU manuscript is simply stunning. It describes liquid fuel and multiple stage rockets. Recovered in Romania in 1961, the 450 page manuscript is filled with technology that is of the modern era. The manuscript's origins aren't very clear nor are the origins of its author who, according to historians, is believed to have been born in either Austrian or Transylvania and became the head of the arsenal of the Austrian Empire under King Ferdinand I. Detailing rocket launches and flying machines in great detail. You have to consider that this was taken from a much older text. This means that 500 years ago, an effort was made to preserve an ancient document. It also means that rocket launches and the ability of flight were at work on this earth many thousands of years ago. And perhaps this document from which the manuscript was written was a survivor piece of the Great Flood. Could the original piece still exist in fragments somewhere you have to wonder? If so, it could give us an idea of how old this information is. There are some who claim that a rocket launch was carried out in CBU in 1550 but there is no known documentary evidence to back up these claims. Very rarely do we come across evidence of ancient technology that is backed up with drawings of how a space rocket should work. It is stunning to think that in this day and age, we are still playing catch up to the ancient technology. We are still rediscovering this knowledge on an almost daily basis, and the fact that we still explain away history as mythology is unbelievable, and it is time for us to wake up. In a stunning twist to the rediscovery of this manuscript, NASA has incredibly acknowledged the 500-year-old document as of major importance to the development of rocket engines and the breakthrough of flight in modern times. NASA acknowledged this on an online page which describes Romanian rocketry in the 16th century and under the category of launch and space vehicles. Isn't that stunning? What do you guys think of the CBU manuscripts? Comments below and thank you for watching.